I visited with him in Israel when I had my trip there. And uh, I met him in Canada many, many times. And, uh, and uh, he was quite a great guy. And when I quit, he gave me hell. He said that winners never quit. And he, he never quit. He stayed there until uh, 92 or 91. Israel lost the giant. And the world lost the giant. As someone who worked so hard for peace uh, with the love of Israel and because of that we need to show respect and support and uh, the Prime Minister wanted uh, our delegation to be non-partisan. Non In all of the uh, years that Canada and Israel has been friends, it doesn't matter whether it's a liberal government, a conservative government, Canada and Israel are great friends and Shimon Peres is really an iconic figure not only to Israelis but to Canadians and to people all over the world, someone who fought for peace in the Middle East between Palestine and Israel. And really, he is a symbol of so much more that needs to be done. Um, and I think he leaves an incredible legacy for those who believe that there's still an opportunity to find peace in the Middle East. So I'm just very honored to attend.